Hello, I'm Natasha Gutierrez. This is the Sports Wrap for Rappler.com. From now until May 2, Rappler will bring you weekly highlights leading up to the Pacquiao-Mayweather fight. The headlines this week. Mayweather rejects Pacquiao's proposal for a $5 million penalty should either player test positive for drugs. Mayweather's uncle boasts the boxer is beating up his sparring partners. And Pacquiao's conditioning coach says boxer Maidana is proof Floyd isn't invincible. For as long as the camps of Manny Pacquiao and Floyd Mayweather have been trading barbs, the issue of drug tests has been part of the mix. So it comes as no surprise that Manny Pacquiao requested for a $5 million penalty should either fighter test positive for a performance-enhancing drug. And it's no surprise either that Mayweather is rejecting the proposal. The fighters agreed to undergo random and urine testing under the United States Anti-Doping Agency, which will screen for steroid and other illegal drugs. But Mayweather promotion CEO Leonard Alaribus says if Cons and Manny didn't communicate with their promoter during negotiations, it's a lame attempt to generate publicity. The fight could be cancelled if either fighter tests positive before the fight. Neither fighter has ever failed a post-fight test. Over at the Pacquiao camp, the Filipino gets a visit from Manila-born former National Football League quarterback Tim Tebow at the wildcard gym of trainer Freddie Roach. Tebow watched Pacquiao train for nearly three hours Saturday, including seven rounds of sparring and eight rounds of punching into mitts. Pacquiao's promoter Bob Arum said it was the first time they had ever met, and yet it seemed they had known each other forever the way they immediately embraced each other. Both Pacquiao and Tebow are openly religious and often talk of their faith. A few days earlier, another athlete, world middleweight champion Jenna D. Golovkin, also paid Pacquiao a visit. But it's not all good news in Pacquiao's camp. Justin Fortune, the strength and conditioning coach of Manny Pacquiao, is fighting throat and neck cancer. Fortune, a former heavyweight boxer, is currently undergoing treatment for his cancer. He has lost 35 kilograms. Despite his illness, Fortune makes a prediction that his fighter's volume punching would hurt Mayweather. And Mayweather's not dancing and looking so pretty now. Fortune says if Marcus Maidana was able to hit Mayweather with his attacks, then Mayweather would be an easy target. Mayweather met Maidana in May 2014 and failed to knock him out, but won by a unanimous decision. Some analysts share Fortune's view. They say the tough fight with Maidana, whom the Wall Street Journal describes as a small welterweight not exactly among the elite of the elite, burst the bubble of Floyd's claim to greatness. Over at Mayweather's camp, his uncle Jeff Mayweather says the undefeated boxer has been beating up his sparring partners. Mayweather's sparring partners are former two-division champion Zab Judah and former 148-pound champ Demarcus Corley, both southpaws. Uncle Jeff told MLive.com that Mayweather has been punishing Judah in particular. He said Mayweather just beat the shit out of him. He beat Judah so bad, Judah was scared to let his hands go. Everybody was just hyped because they thought Judah was going to be something different. But Judah was worse than the other guys. And while Pacquiao has his share of fans, other athletes also express support for Mayweather. Former world champion Saul Canelo Alvarez says Mayweather's style of fighting would dictate the pace of the fight, while Filipino-American Lakers player Jordan Clarkson says he admires Pacquiao but admits his favorite fighter is Mayweather. The winner of the biggest boxing fight in recent history will not only earn the title of best pound-for-pound -pound boxer in the world, he will also get an emerald green and diamond encrusted belt from the World Boxing Council or the WBC. The WBC recently held a public poll to choose between an unusual onyx design and the more traditional green strap, with green winning by 53% of the votes. The belt is worth $1 million and comes as a bonus to the winner. Mayweather is expected to receive $180 million in cold cash, while Pacquiao is estimated to earn a 40% cut of $120 million. Tell us what you think of the upcoming fight. Share your own fearless forecast in the comments section. Rappler will be bringing you updates each week as we count down to the fight of this century on May 2. Until the next time, see you around.